<sighs> okay, let's catch the kids. Do you, want, do you want me to catch the kids? Catching kids. No, I, I, like this one's a tough one. I think I can get the other one. Uh, he fell down. For real? Where is he? He's no, no, no. To the right, to the, to the north part of this there. Oh. Hey, welcome to Override, the show where we rethink games and chase after children. Um, hello, bank guy, you're the best. Goodbye, bank guy. Okay. I think the last kid is over here. Oh, also, quick look. Uh, the tower is, like, coming along. Yeah. Okay, whatever. Last kid. I'm pretty sure he's left here. In the crate. Somewhere? No. Not in the crate. Where is he? And, oh, that's that's the 3DS version as well. <sighs> Dude, why are we so bad at video games? No, he has to be around here somewhere. Like, I am I am so sure. Should have done this off camera. No, no, but we no. need to show the people, like, how are they gonna rethink games if we don't show them everything? Oh my god, so much stress. I can't deal with this right now. Where is the kid? There's, there's, there's four of them. I'm missing one. There, there he is. is. How did we miss this? There, there, there we go. Okay, so you got you got the kids. You're pretty good for a Deku scrub. Hey, I find that offensive. Well, if only you were human, then I could give you an original bomber's notebook and make you a member. What do you guys think? No way, no scrubs. We like that one TLC song from the '90s. Well, guess not. Once we let, <laughs> we can't we can't sing the song because it's copyright infringement. Well, you guys know what song I'm, what song I'm talking about. Literally, no idea what song you're talking about. The scrub song. Yeah. Um. Anyway, there's two theories about this. That just they just told you that once they let a kid who wasn't human right. join their gang, it's either the skull kid or four one three two five. Okay. It's either the skull kid or the um dead scrub that we saw like two episodes ago. Yeah, I think the 3ds remake clarifies it to be the skull kid actually. Really? Yes, I'm. I'm ninety percent positive the the 3D 3DS version makes it clear that it, it was the Skull Kid they let in. Yes, they do because they changed something in the 3DS version. Um, uh, I, I actually don't want to spoil it, but but like they changed a little bit of, of of how you get an item in the game in the 3DS version, and like the reason they use is it belonged to the Skull Kid, but since like he doesn't care about it anymore, now you get it. Okay. Do you remember what the passcode is, by the way? Yeah, four one three two five. Yeah, guys, I literally just forgot it. Three two, two five. five. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure this is a randomly generated number in some in some way, but there is like certain parameters it must follow, so that yeah. they they are all like. But there is all there five is, digits are different. Yeah, there is continuity. With um within a single save file. Yes, I'm. I'm in which, if we erase this file, I'm fairly certain that it's the same number if we start over i mean if that's if that's correct and make sure to like comment and subscribe if you can confirm and that tell me that i'm wrong Please then tell me that I'm wrong. it's it's good it's interesting because it's it means that the programmers were using some kind of directory filing system to a certain like to to make the game decide what that number is supposed to be as right. opposed to um establishing some kind of random number generator within the game uh, which would make sense because random number generators do take up like memory space that you can probably use for more for other things in the game um, if you can find a way to avoid using it. So, uh, big balloon. Uh, I keep trying to use motion controls. What? Because the 3DS version has motion controls. Yeah. Anyway. I think we've been playing the 3DS version too much. Yes. We are playing the OG over here. So we come over here and we get, I think my favorite one of my favorite game like sound musics in this game this is a pretty neat song yeah it's it's like like wait like let's, and you let's, literally let's, only hear it twice yeah let's let's stop and like give it a listen for a second because this is special right. yeah like did you hear that like like there's something very like like it's it's nice. It's it's kind of like one of those like music boxes. It's very things. relaxing. It's a very but it's relaxing also song. very like sad and melancholic, isn't it? Yeah. It's it's like like this song is has been stuck in my head since I first played like Majors Mask way back when. 
um, there's something just really like um, emotional and touching about it. Like, I don't know. I just think it's very good, and, and I think it, it's very powerful in how it like gets right to. I think making you think think about. Stuff. I don't know if every song in this game, but most of the songs that were made originally for this game are very sad. Yeah, the, the like the original compositions for this game. Yeah. Will you gaze into the telescope? Sure, old yes. man. Yes, I am. I'll, I'll look You're gonna the get the butt. Anyway, uh, so we're looking through the telescope. Uh, there's, so oh, look, there's some guy trying to get money. And if we look over here, we can see the clock tower. And if we zoom in, there's the asshole who stole our horse! The school kid with the mask! And, and oh my god, thing. there's the moon! It's crying. It's horrendous. And it's crying. And it's crying for some reason. Yeah. Do, do, do moons cry? Well, I think this one does. And you get the butt. There it is. And, and yeah, he's mooning us. No respect. He, Come on, man. We're the hero of he time. Knows, he knows you're right there, though. Yeah, isn't that creepy? It, it is super creepy. Uh, perhaps another moon tear has fallen nearby. Okay, so that... So... The moon is crying, so let's go, like, pick up its tears, which break through the ground, apparently. Uh, I, is, I, don't, I don't know if you've noticed, but it's kind of, like, fun that uh, Deku Scrub has to do, like, a little jumpy thing to, like, open to, the like, door. To open the door, yeah, it's hilarious. It's, it's, it's the details, man. It's like, it's, it's like those yep. Nintendo details that make all the difference. Uh, actually, I've never checked... So, um, um, faithful audience, if you can check this for me, I'm not sure, but I think, like, I think this is always here, and the telescope simply won't let you see, like, this directly down except for that cutscene, to hide the fact that, like, the crater, like, the image for this crater is here. But I might be wrong about that, so, like, if, if I am wrong about that, make sure to, like, leave your comment down below correcting me. I wouldn't know. I've never opened that door before checking the telescope. Uh, I don't... Like, can you? I'm not I, sure you can. I don't... I think you can. I should have checked that beforehand. Do you want to make time go faster? Oh, yeah. Let's let's yeah. show that mechanic. So, yeah. so yeah. like, if you remember the, the Scarecrows from Ocarina of Time, like, here they are again. But they're not quite the Scarecrows from Ocarina of Time. Like, he's a styling Scarecrow in search of peasant music. Time will pass in the blink of an eye if you dance with me. So in this game, instead of being like hookshot targets, <laughs> which is exactly what they were, um, like they are time passage. Um, shall we dance? Shall we dance? Yes, sure. Let's. Wee dance. wee. Oh yeah! In that case, forget the time. Let's, let's dance. dance. Let's dance. And then you start dancing and to Saria's song from Ocarina of Time. This is the only time that song appears, actually. Yeah. I think. No. There's another moment where that song appears in this game. There is? Yep. Oh, we're we'll, gonna see we'll, it. We'll see it when we see it. So, yeah. it is the final day. And, oh yeah, how was it? How was it? I can't even talk for it anymore. <laughs> how was it? It went by in an instant, right? I'm still full of energy. If you like, baby, we can forget the time and dance until night. No, I, I'm not sure I want to, like, dance for another 12 hours with some, like, scarecrow. You want to learn what? The song. Oh yeah, now listen up. If you play that strange song backwards, uh, I think he's talking about the song time, you yep. can slow the flow of time. And if you play each note twice in a row, you can move a half day forward through time. Like, I know kids back in the day didn't like reading this stuff, but like, this is literally explaining like important game mechanics. That aren't going to be shown in the menu, by the way. Yes, that, that I'm pretty sure most kids back in the day like figured out by reading some like guide on the internet and not like by <laughs> playing the game proper but yeah it's the dawn of the final day i love um, by the way i love that you're like me and you break every single pot that you can get your hands on dude i i've been trained by zelda to break <laughs> pottery wherever i see it like ganon is not link's mortal enemy it's pottery like pots must be destroyed well except for breath of the wild link i think he doesn't break pots and grass must be mowed and grass must be mown. That is that is so true. Uh, but yeah. So, it's the dawn of the final day. Each, anyway, each... now that we're back, I think we're gonna 
stop this episode right here. And oh, is it time already? Yeah, it's time I, already. I, I, I've been, I've been, I've, I've been literally so never ready. done this before, so I don't know the words even. But it's time. It's time. All right. Well, I'll yeah. see you guys in the next see one. See you guys for in the next one. The final day. Bye. -bye.